guys, welcome back to my channel. The air conditioner just turned on. I'm sorry if you can hear that, but it is Amanda Lee here, and today I'm going to be bringing you along in a day of my life as a broke online student. So I've been in online college for quite some time, about a year and a half now. I'm about to finish my two-year degree next spring. I am at DZone BTQ, if you can't tell. I spend a lot of my days here. I hang out here all the time and kind of mooch on the Wi-Fi and do a lot of my schoolwork, and it's a pretty fun time, so let's get to it. Mm -hmm. Days at these don't begin at 12 p.m. So I usually start to eat a lunch as soon as I get here. And I munch on it for a little while. This is 12 grams of protein. My wonderful boyfriend got this for me today. It's dairy free and gluten free. So shout out to him. This morning I had a bowl of oats and I'll put a picture in here of the oatmeal I used. I've had it for about a month and I haven't had my breakfast in a very long time. So I really appreciate it. Shoe check. These are some of my favorite shows. Okay, it is three o'clock. My meeting with my professor is at four. It's 5 p.m. Eastern time, but I'm in Central time. So we're outside taking a little break. It feels so nice outside. Autumn is finally here. That's what my planner at least says. And I just wanna say thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I know we're not too far into the video yet, but I just genuinely appreciate having you guys around. And it makes me feel all warm and fuzzy inside while it's all muggy and cold outside. in the cloud light looking fucking just like all those clouds look silver car gray sky gray car gray sky is silver the same color as gray oh my gosh wait i think so why do we call it all right anyways will you record my outfit really quick i have an iou iou sweater on and then i've got my nikes that have trees on the back of them and then Taco hamburger, no, taco hot dog pizza socks. Who doesn't like taco hot dog pizza socks? That's my best part. And then my boyfriend's belt. I'm gonna confide in you guys a little bit. I grew up in a tiny little bumpkin town. I have never been a big person who's known a lot about fashion. I've always known that I've wanted to know about fashion. But then again, where do you freaking start? You know you wanna know something about something. Who knows what they don't know? I mean, come on. So when I met Sheldon and just learning more about their D zone and knowing this is an I owe you sweater, just what does that even mean? Like I owe you something for wearing my sweater? My gosh, fashion is just, it's such a cool, crazy, crunk little world. I'm glad to have finally figured out how to be a part of it. We're gonna go ahead and set everything up inside of Dory. I am freaking nervous. For those who don't know, I have, I might put that in the thumbnail. I have never had a Zoom meeting before with any of my professors. This is my sixth, maybe seventh semester online, and I've never met face to face with any of my professors. My sister is going to the same university as I am. We're on the same scholarship, and she's the same way, except one time a professor asked to Skype her, and because of our inexperience, I literally thought that was so weird. I was like, why does he want to talk to you personally? That's odd. It's a little stressful, so I'm glad you guys are here to kind of help me out. Also, I know I might be talking a little loud, but look how open the space is, and look at all the people who are able to drive by and just say hello while I talk to my camera. I hope you guys are here for it. <laughs> I'm gonna move my seat back. Oh, I think I'm gonna set my laptop up over here. So I'm gonna take my little mount off. Oh God, I don't wanna break it. I spent like $18 on this thing. Oh, do you guys see that? It's happening! It hurts my thumb so bad! Chiga. Oh, why'd they do that? Okay. It's 3.31 and we're looking good. We've connected the Wi-Fi. So we're in the car and we're on Wi-Fi. 
Okay, so my professor finished her meeting early and I'm at a crossroads. I don't know what to do. I think I'm not gonna do it. This was definitely not in my research on the wiki forum of whenever you Zoom your professor for the first time. I cleaned out the back part and I found highlighters that I bought so long ago and I forgot I had them. They're not very expensive or very snazzy, but they get the job done. Okay, okay, anyway, I think I'm gonna go ahead and call her. I might just go ahead and shoot for the stars. I'm so nervous, okay. I look comfortable. Open Zoom meetings. Yes! Can you... What if she can only hear me? Is she... Oh no, I'm really anxious. Now I'm nervous. I didn't test my camera. Okay, it's okay. Is there a button on my computer that will tell me if my camera's on? I didn't wear a mask to this meeting, Miss Sherry. My fly is coming undone. I don't even have a fly. They're all buttons. What am I saying? Ah! Uh, test computer audio. We just Oh, microphone is working. Perfect. Output level for my speaker. Up, 100. Perfect. Video. Oh, okay. I do look okay. I can see myself in here and things are looking okay. All right, I'll keep it right there. She can't see my my mirror, right? My rear view mirror. There's a lot going on, okay? Which is good. I kind of wanted that. I'm in the middle! I actually, believe it or not, took a course on how to make presentations and how to talk to somebody over a presentation, like virtually or whatever, and it was grueling, but I feel very excited. And I think it helped me with my YouTube a little bit. Subscribe if you notice a difference. Am I still waiting? So she's not starting it. Maybe I should message. I'll message. Hello. Do you have my drink? My cup? No. We're just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna full, full, full. I can't find my mouse. Send. All right, I have notes. I herbal. I've got something to take notes. I have now got highlighters. I switched the camera so I could change it to a time lapse so you guys could hear me say hello, but then you don't have to hear the whole thing. I'm sure you're not very interested. I am sweating. It might be because I'm in this time a little nervous, but oh my gosh. First Zoom call, I can, I can do. I'm not even gonna start singing. Enter her name. You get to choose every time? I'm waiting. Hello? Hi, can you hear Hello, me okay? I can, yes. Oh, it's so <laughs> nice to meet you, Dr. Gaddy. Can you see me? I can see you. Amazing. Okay. I apologize for being in my car. I promise I'm not going to scoot off on you. It's just the oh, quietest okay. place I have right now. Yeah, not a problem. And if it's easier for you to be someplace else where it's not quiet, that's fine. Oh, okay. Yeah, don't worry about it. The car is pretty comfy, so. <laughs> You will definitely see, again, a much more improved paper this <laughs> Sunday. Sounds good. All right, thank you. you. Have a good night. You too. Bye-bye. Bye. We did it! The time is 4.46. My professor was a hoot, and the Zoom meeting went really, really well. I don't have any classes, or I haven't had any classes so far even, that have forced me to have any kind of interaction with my professors except for the messaging back and forth. So I really can say that I've taken away a lot from the Zoom call that I would not have gotten in an email, that I would not have gotten in a discussion response. Just reach out and take the help whenever you need it. Okay, stop being stubborn. I know I needed that advice. You could use it too. To be honest, this is a little eye-opening to me because as someone who's been an online student for such a long period of time and not been required to have those face-to-face -face meetings, I genuinely feel like 
my education experience would be much more improved if my university was forcing us to have those face-to-face -face meetings because a lot of you, I mean, a lot of you know, I'm t you have your Zoom classes, you have your uh, calls and everything, but imagine being an online student and not having any of that at all. Literally, there have been weeks where I have gone speaking to exactly one person and that is my boyfriend. <laughs> so I just wanna say that maybe I should reach out more often and I hope so. I hope you have this idea as well. Maybe you're having a moment too, but maybe I should reach out more often to my professors, even my classmates, because a lot of it's in my hands. I'm coming to realize that I have 25 people in the class that I just Skype with that professor with and why have I not reached out to them about assignments? Why am I so afraid to take the plunge? I think I'm definitely going to be speaking to a couple of my classmates about their essays. And I think I'm going to try to start working on that. I'm going to try to start working on that. We're cool. I can do it. Alden and I just got back and I got into comfy clothes. I still got my socks on but we've got to go back because we forgot our chicken nuggets so save the nugs these are the chicken nuggets that we use they're gluten free they're organic they're super super bomb there's not that many in here though i will say three pieces of serving there's only about eight so it's three times eight which is like four not a bunch it is seven dollars so do with that what you will crispy I could do this today. Fidget nugget. Mm -hmm. uh, no. Oh. No. Taters and tendies. Taters and tendies. Oh, and on that note, thank you all so much for hanging out with me today. I'm going to finish up all this wonderful dinner. Probably watch way too much Dr. Phil, a few cute English Bulldog videos, and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know if you'd like more little videos like this. I had so much fun today, and I just really appreciate you guys hanging out with me throughout the day. So I'll talk to you later. Have a good night, day, whatever it is, wherever you are. And let's create our crunkness. I'll talk to you tomorrow.